Well, hello once again, ladies and gentlemen. We are back with more fear. And we are going to do a particularly difficult area here. So hopefully we won't die like a bitch. Wait back here. They come up the stairs and we can funnel them right to us. I'm good, just heading to my death. Here I go. Oh. Nice grenade, idiot. Come on. <laughs> They're probably going to head to the right and then come over. Oh, no. See, they didn't do what I expected. That's why this game is good. Whoa. Come on, man. I'm right here. Send more fodder, more cannon fodder to the front lines. Woo. <clears throat> hmm. Sneak back here. Oh, there's one guy back there. That I'm stuck down here. Fuck. It was a bad idea. Get shot climbing up this fucking thing. Whoa! Hey. When they say check in, it sounds like they're saying chicken. It's like, squad! Thai chicken for dinner tonight? Yeah, sounds good. I know a great place on 5th and 8th. A bunch more that start to spawn, I think, up here? Also, I thought there was a med kit or something. No, there's not. How much ammo do we have for this? Oh, we, okay, we're doing pretty well for ammo. <clears throat> okay. Over the barrier and into the next area. Okay, 27 shots until we got to go back to the inferior machine guns. Game Boy Advancing. Playing Golden Sun for Game Boy Advance. That game fucking rocks, by the way. If you've never played Golden Sun uh, for Game Boy Advance, play it. Man, fucking fantastic. <clears throat> you can emulate it. Um. The intro to that game is kind of long, that's the only criticism I really, really have about it. Am I stuck on a texture? Fucking hell. Oh ho 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 ho, the shotgun. Okay, since we're so low on pistol ammo, we're gonna grab the shotgun, which is a fan fucking tastic shotgun. Um, when it comes to video game shotguns, this is a good one. And can we grab extra ammo for this? Did anybody else drop a shotgun? No, just that guy. Okay. Well, I don't know, maybe we shouldn't get rid of the pistols. Kind of... Hmm. Uh, the pistols are so much fun, man. It's a hard choice. You know what we're gonna do? I'm gonna drop this gun. Did I just lose my second pistol? Did it fall in there? Look. Down there? Shit, man. Yeah, we're gonna keep our, our dual pistols, I think. <clears throat> and we'll just get rid of that shitty... That shitty assault rifle. I, I, li I like the other one better. I like the, the default one better than that. I think the recoil not being as, as bad is, um, is worth the slightly worse DPS. 
I've calculated that there's a 0.2% decrease in DPS, but a 5% decrease in recoil, so I think it's a worthwhile exchange. So, now we've got the shotgun, though. We can really start gaming here. Now... I don't hear anything useful? No. Don't worry if you hear explosions and screams and bloody murder right next to you. We have it under control. Just don't panic. Thank you for listening. <clears throat> well, I feel comforted and uh, I feel like I'm ready to go back to work and not pay attention to anything. Thank you very much, Radio Man. Now, get our John Woo pistols back here for the next part. This valve puzzle. <clears throat> and now that we've filled that little chasm with water, we can navigate it. Silence. <laughs> Fucking love that shit. Woo! Slow motion chaos. Hey, let's do our little Super Mario puzzle here. Oh, I always fucking fall there. Fuck off. God damn it. Okay. The buckets of the ancients there. Alright, we're out of ammo for those. We got contact with Jody Foster. The scene where they fake the mirror shot is really cool. Woo! These guys kill themselves with their own grenades quite often. Oh, mommy, I need help. Your mommy's nowhere to be found. There's just me helping you with lead. Did any of you drop shotgun ammo is the question. That's important. Yes, very good. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's a fucked up story. I was at I was at the pool one time, and um, there's always like 500 nasty old men wandering around. Um, and there was this fucking guy. I don't know if he was a, he was Eastern European or something, but he was in the change room and he was he was joking around with one of his friends, and his laugh was like the funniest old man laugh I've ever heard in my life. It sounded like this. He you know, he was he was speaking some kind of I don't know, some kind of Scandinavian language or Eastern European. I don't know what he was speaking, but he was, you know, joking around with his friend going <laughs> and then he would laugh and he would go <laughs> Sounded like a fucking <laughs> sounded like a video game character. It was the funniest shit. I was like trying not to laugh um changing out of my fucking shorts. That was that was funny shit. God damn. Well, this part is so Kino with the lighting. some landmines and shit up here, I think. <clears throat> One of the most fun sections of this game um, <clears throat> is where you have to uh, you have to prepare an area for an ambush, and uh, <clears throat> you get the opportunity to go in and set up landmines everywhere, and if you put them in the right spots, it's so much fun, because they'll walk right into them, and if you're in slow-mo, you can watch them just fly into the air when they explode. I mean, this game is so fucking satisfying, man. Ah, oh, the lighting of the ancients, the lighting of yore, the lighting of yore from 2004. Okay, so this is one example of that. So we need to swap our grenades here. So if we throw one of these up, oh, whoops. Fuck off, dude. Oh, shit. Okay, well. Oh, death number two, I think. Fuck me.
Whoop. I heard that grenade, you little fucker. In the dick. Thought that was a grenade. Fuck. All right, where's the shotgun? That's the question. Up on top? Where the fuck did it go? Up top. Ooh. Right, right, right. What about in here? Is this... Okay, that's the next area. Right, right, right. Yes, yes, yes. Quite, quite, quite. Grab the shoddy from up here. Is it, is it different? Oh no, okay. Whoops, why the fuck does that pause key exist? Okay. <clears throat> All right, so, how did we die? We died to the guy up top. Actually, this, this particular area is perfect for the shotgun, so we're gonna use the shotgun for this. Close quarters combat. Oh, you've become a red mist. Oh! Crawling under the environmental object. Look at that. That is fucking cool, man. God damn, right in the crotch. Ooh! Wee! <laughs> Fuck, man, this game is so much fun. They don't make them like this anymore. All right. Okie dokie now. And we're going to get a new weapon in a minute here, so I think we will give up the epic pistols for it, since they're out of ammo anyway. Jesus, that guy hits hard. Uh, and we got to pick up those landmines. Those are going to be useful. Um, am I walking or am I... No, I'm running. Okay. I'm running fast like Sonic, huh? I remember when I was a kid, when I, tur when I turned 10, I think, or sometime around then, I was really into Sonic at that age, which is the age you're supposed to be into it. And, uh, I got this birthday cake from Dairy Queen that had Sonic on it, and I was fucking, I was like, I was like the happiest I'd been in my whole life, just to get that cake. You've got to do what you can in your life to preserve that sense of, like, childlike wonder at how simple things are, are fun and, and good. Uh, it sounds, you know, lame, the way I just put it, but what I'm trying to say is, don't let life turn you into a sour, um, <clears throat> a sour prick. Um, you know, we all go through shitty times in our lives, and if you let it depress, if you let life, uh, get you down and depress you, that won't help. Uh, you're not, like, I went through this in my 20s where I was like, I was like, oh, like, to be, <clears throat> to be mature, I have to be grim and serious and edgy, and I have to respond to, to life by being cynical. And I, I conflated that kind of emotional, um, immaturity with maturity, which is something that most people go through in their teens. And I went through it in my 20s, because I'm retarded. But uh, if, you're, if you're ever going through that type of thing in your life where you just feel like you're on, the only way to respond to life, to cope, is to become a cynic or, or to become a nihilist or to whatever, anything, anything like that. That's not the, that's not the right move. <clears throat> um, it's not... Uh, it won't benefit you. It will make things worse, in fact. Um, and I'm not saying we should all be like you know, arrested development, you know, um, childlike moron idiots. I'm not saying that. I'm saying preserve your appreciation for the simple joys of life however you can. Like, preserve your sense of, of life's um, <clears throat> simple pleasures that don't require huge investments of time and money. Like, a good cup of coffee. It's Again, it sounds lame. It sounds like I'm, you know, you know trying to... I don't know, sing kumbaya and hold hands. That's, that's not what I'm saying. I'm not saying become like a deluded moron. Um, I'm saying don't, don't allow life to grind you down to the point where you think being edgy is, is the only thing that's going to help you. Because it doesn't. It never helps. It never helps. There's, no, there's literally no situation ever where that attitude is good. It's always stupid. Now, can we aim our grenade... 
Maybe that's not ideal, but... Okay, that's pretty good. All right, now, what did we get? Some pi Oh, we got some pistol ammo, hell yeah. All right, so we're gonna stick with the shotgun because we got a, we've got a heavy, a tank is inbound. Is there a secret down here? No, Ooh. guy down there. He's just sleeping, he's having a nap. All right, now we're not gonna set off our own grenades here. Whoa, slow-mo activated for us there. Okay, gotta be careful with this guy because he will fuck you up. That guy's dead. Those are so tanky, man. Shit, where did he go? Fuck. Did he die? Dead? Oh, he's not. He's f See, they, he's fucking hiding. Look at that. Fuck you, you prick. Now, this gun that we're about to get... Look at the shell casing there. The gun we're about to get, <clears throat> it shoots depleted uranium rods. Uh, and it's, it's kind of badass. Um, I'm wondering if we should get rid of the shotgun for this. The shotgun in this game is great, but... Close quarters combat in this is actually pretty, pretty, uh, on a, it's, it's not ideal on the higher difficulties. Close quarters combat, you end up, you end up dying too quickly for it to be viable. So I'm wondering if I should swap for this. Hmm. We may have to give up our epic pistols. I don't want to, though. I think we're going to give this up because these guns are pretty ubiquitous. So we're going to get the, the HV Penetrator, as I used to call it when I played this game. The HIV Penetrator. The HIV Penetrator. I am going to infect you. All right. Let's get through this little door here. Smoke effects, very epic. God, that amber light. Love it. Think, we're proper safety equipment. Well, thanks for telling me, bro. Shit, looks like these fuckers are pulling out. I'm seeing a substantial mobilization of- They're using the pull-out method. It's not 100% effective because pre-cum can still contain sperm. All right, let's see about... There's a fucking thing under there. It's so sad. I know I, I know where all this shit is, but man. Ah, you know what? I'm not ashamed. Fuck it, I love this game. You should really play this if you've never played it before. It's fantastic. It's better than any game that's come out um, that's, that's similar to it since, in my opinion. Okay, come on. Up and walk a little quicker here. Right, all right, all right. out of him. Such a satisfying gun. Oh, I see you, little bastard. Look at him climb the ladder there. And if you get a headshot with this thing, usually it's a one-shot kill, one or two shots. So the ammo for this really is... Uh, it lasts. It's a great gun. Okay. Walking? What do we do? Great. Ah, ooh, yes. Man. Why you gotta be like that game? Woo! Checkpoint of the Ancients has been reached. Very good. Do this little valve puzzle here. kind of a passive-aggressive criticism calling these valve puzzles, but every game at this time period had these. Every every single one of these fucking games was was <clears throat> copying Half-Life 2, which is a great game. I really should play that on this channel. I think I will at some point. Uh, Half-Life 2 is like... I mean, that game is perfect. I, I think I only have one perfect game on Steam, and it's Half-Life 2. 
Um, that game's story, soundtrack, sound design, voice acting, ev everything. Everything is like perfect. Like it's one of those. It's one of those games where you're like, it's just. I can't really find any flaws with it. It's it's kind of kind of perfect. Um. <clears throat> Oh, we've got an interdimensional being there. Before we go up here, I think there's a, there's a little Easter egg down here that I missed. I'm just going to backtrack for a second, y'all. See what's in here. Ooh. Aha, see, there's more HIV penetrator ammo. So we're going to drop this bad boy very carefully. Not pause the game, you fucking idiot. We're going to pick this up. Ammo for this is pretty scarce, so you definitely want to use the drop trick. Grab it. That's a madman tip. Madman tip number one. When you have the HIV penetrator, conserve your ammo. Same thing with the shoddy here. Very good, very good. Do we like that? We like to use the ammo drop trick. When I'm playing uh, Fear in my in my prison cell, I like to use the drop trick. It, it conserves ammo. It's very good. You don't want to waste ammo in this game. It's uh, it's not a good idea to waste your ammunition. It's it's. I think that's something that the Democrats would do. They would waste ammo. I've seen many cases when uh, you know Hillary Hillary and Bill and I we were at the shooting range and they were wasting ammo and I said. That's not good. You're not good at shooting. You're not very good at it. I'm much better than you. I am better. I am good. I am cool. Uh oh. I don't know what you're talking about. Where are the Mar-a-Lago documents? Deeper than others, but I know where to dig. No, wait. You've got the wrong guy. Hush now, Mr. Moody. The time for talk is done. The time for butt stuff is now. I know where to dig in your ass. Okay. Ugh. <coughs> Woo. Uh oh. Lilith is calling me. Let's go see what she wants. Woo! Son of a bitch. <laughs> I forgot that was a thing. Fuck, man. Uh. <laughs> it got me spooked, ladies and germs. Oh man, that lighting. God damn. This playthrough is just going to be me going, Lighting, I like it! <laughs> it's going to be half the fucking playthrough, man. Oh fuck, this part fucking freaks me out every time. Uh, let's see, we get the John Whoop? No, the pistol ammo is not. Get the shotgun out here. You turn around and the game goes, Whoop! Jump scared, Whoa! See, that's the thing, is you think, oh, there's... There was one jump scare. And they hit you with another one right away. Once, once you, once your heart rate's about to go down, they fuck with you again. Great. Hmm. I think we need to adjust the pressure on valve four. It'd save us 0.3 BTUs of propane every year. A devastating explosion in the harbor this evening may not have been an accident. We have learned. A devastating explosion in my pants may not have been an accident. All right. Some of these paint cans will actually paint the walls when you shoot them. What's the brand name here? Runnels. That's my favorite paint. Woo. Some of them actually, though, if you if you shoot them, they'll they'll spray white paint on the walls. It's funny. Um, now there's an Easter egg down here, but we have to go a roundabout way to obtain it. We have to go this way. I think so. Okay. Okay, let's pop down here. Poor bastard. We wasted all our fucking shotgun ammo shooting paint cans, so let's grab some more. Very nice. And again, I usually have I usually have full grenades in this because I don't I don't use the grenades that much. I mean, I should. It's it's a lot of fun 
to do the whole slow motion, throw a grenade, shoot it in midair thing. But I, I, I got to be honest, it's kind of hard to pull that off. Um, you got to be really, really accurate when you do that, or you just end up wasting ammo and grenades. <clears throat> All right, let's see about what's going on up here. Nice little Easter egg up here for us. Oh, there's, there's our little, our little, our little lovely GF. Oh, Kawaii. Japan has a real problem with Ophelia. It's not funny. <laughs> they are very fucked up culturally. It's a big, creepy problem. Let's grab an extra piss tool over here. Grab our other one here. And I'm wondering, I think that drop trick wouldn't work a second time. Let's check out the developer here. wonder who this guy was. Longshoreman Digest, old time trapper. <laughs> old time crapper. Boo! See what, uh, see what the low res, low poly uh, phone has to say over here. I've got hives. Just focus on adding more fluoride. That's all they said. Just don't ask questions. Don't rebel. Don't even protest. Just drink the water and go to sleep. Now, what do we have here? Oh yes, the developers of the game listed as an epic joke. Keep this room clean. How ironic. <clears throat> I love how your ears ring after stuff blows up in this too. There's a little bit of ee. You now know about tinnitus. You now think you have it. You're now breathing manually. <laughs> <laughs> You're now reading this in my voice. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking love that green text, man. All right. See, we've got nine med kits now. This always happens to me at some point. Ooh. Maybe that's Mr. Hives. Woo. His hives, he succumbed to his hives. He had herpes and didn't get it checked out. And his brain turned to porridge. Uh, okay. Oh. I don't think we need to go down here, do we? Does this not go anywhere? Oh no, that actually does. I think there's a... A little passageway? Yeah, boy. Dirty rat! Fuck you! Give me my vaccine, oh yeah! Mm, I love that shit. Give me that shit in my veins. Hook my veins up to a septic tank. Fill my veins with shit! Inject me with parasite eggs that make little cancerous cysts in my organs. Mmm, oh, yes, I'm so fucking ready for that. Mr. Hives, where are you going? It's fluoride, I understand the reference. Ooh. Shut me out? Uh-oh. Did you guys not see the keep this place clean sign? Look at this mess. Jesus. So hard to find good ha janitorial help these days. Uh huh, I shot the glass in the cutscene. I didn't know you could do that. Lois, are you in here? What's going on? Oh, there's a ghost man. Oh. Whoa, shit. That fucking got me. God damn it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Gonna fuck with me from behind. Ooh, -hoo. very epic. Okay. Oh, I think she runs out from behind the. Doesn't she? Okay. Now this area is a challenge because there's multiple levels, multiple layers, and these fucks will um gang up on you. And uh, shoot at you from multiple angles at once. And it's very easy to die, like, instantly. So we're going to keep our piss tools handy here. And we're going to do some, some John Woo slow motion pissing. Challenge pissing. Can you shoot six feet into the air and not get wet? Don't end up like Mr. Hives here. Woo!
going to save, actually, because this, this room sucks. I always die in here. Lad water. What happened in Ohio? What's in the water, Mr. Hives? Is that what gave you hives? Gotta check his body to figure the... And I'm going to hazard a guess. It's probably the ghost girl, if I had to guess. Fuck, man. I'm fucking this up. Fuck, man, I hate this room. <laughs> All right, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go with the shotgun, I think. That is probably a better hit. The whole squad, I only killed two of them. There's like six of you in here, man. Learn to speak, dumbass. Squad, use cover, girl. You're worth it. That all of them? Done? All right. Party's over, boys. Looks like I'm the birthday boy now. Woo! Look at that reflection, that's pretty impressive for 2004, I gotta say. Now, can we grab some extra shotgun ammo? Let's go ahead and do that. These guys never have pistols. I think uh, I think the only way to get pistols is you have to find them. Um, which is a shame, because I love the pistols in this, man. I love the... I love them. Grab some of those. Bada bing, bada boom. Now... Fuck her up there. I think I heard someone getting shot. I'm not sure. Back it up. Back that. Back that get up. Show your cat for the Rizzler. You skibbity the whole squad. I don't know what these Gen Alpha words mean. <laughs> I'm, I'm so fucking out of touch, man. Oh shit, are we almost out of pistol ammo? We got 30 shots. Stick your gun up for the Rizzler! Woo! Well, you can't really set off the gas there. Now, there's a bunch of random shit up here. Oh, so we have to figure out how to get up there. Oh, whoops. Okay. Whoa, what the fuck? I didn't mean to do that. Uh, let's do the shotgun trick again. Oh no, don't fuck it. Yeah, 168 shots, motherfucker. Oh, can't jump up there. Be careful, because I think if you shoot that, you can easily blow yourself up. Uh, back here. If you're sneaky, you can sneak around up here and you can snipe them from up here. This is a lot of fun. I've done that a few times. Um, 
Now, look across y'all. We get the swooty, I'm coming for the booty. Oh, okay, we gotta be tactful about this. Uh, fuck. God damn it. Okay, we gotta drop the HIV penetrator. Let's do that in here. Hopefully it doesn't clip through the textures, which does happen occasionally. Okay, good. Quickly grab this bad boy. Some ex extra epic blue grenades. Is there anything else in here? Should be something up here. If I was a game developer, I would have put a secret item up there. Aha, here's where it is. I fucking knew there was something up here. Spread them, boys. Spread your cheeks and find what's inside. One of those guys has a penetrator, too. Fuck yeah, man. Are there any more of them? So was it. Very epic. Okay. Make our way back through ya. Back down ya. And on to the next area. Oh shit. Careful, because they like to spawn shit tons of enemies in big areas like this. I love how it pins them to the walls. Holy fuck, that's cool. Now, go ahead and that again, yeah. Be good, very good. Hundred shots for this thing. Fuck yes. What we like. Gotta check every area, man, because they will, if there are any guys left behind, they will very quietly catch up to you. And it's very easy to just randomly die, and you're like, what the fuck, where did I get shot from? And the guy was fucking behind you. And you didn't even hear him. Depends on the enemy. Some of them are a lot louder than others. Um, so you can hear their footsteps or whatever, but there are some that are very, they can be very quiet if they, if the AI, um, uh, tells them to be. Okay, great. Fuck, we have so many, so much uh, ammo for this. 182 shots. Hell yeah. Oh, fuck. Don't do that. I'm gonna pick up the fucking med... See, I'm already maxed out on med kits. Because I'm an epic gamer. Epic pro for the gamer. Shitty weapon, we don't need that. All right, all right, let's get a diet squish. Very delicious, and we'll move on with our lives. Okay. What fresh hell awaits us here? Man. Fuck, fuck. Stuck in a hallway. Shooting gallery. Jumped down. Why would you jump down there? It. The guy jumped down here? I sworn I heard him. Those fucks do that. Any good weapons up here? No, nothing. I call this piece Clone Pinned to Wall, MoMA 2024. I think it's, it says a lot more, it expresses a lot more than my last piece, Banana Duct Taped to Wall. I think Clone 
stuck to wall with HIV penetrator depleted uranium rod. I think it says a lot more about our society and how it's bad, actually, and we should burn everything down and restart it. And everyone should listen to me because I'm a mentally ill artist, and I definitely know what's best for all of society. In here. Can we not go anywhere else? No. Okay. Jumping into the loading screen. Once the vampire's telepathic link with his thralls is broken, they'll turn back into empty-headed NPCs with no souls. Golems. Complete idiots. Then they'll basically just stand there crapping their pants until we round them up and grind them into hamburger meat for McDonald's. Fucking phones! You don't have a cell phone? Fucking dumbass. Ooh, I see you planting landmines, you dirty boy. Hey. Ah, oh, yes, the generator of the ancients. Now, what do we have here? We have proper safety equipment. Maybe you should have installed this sign properly so it's not clipping through the textures and going over a, a little indentation in the wall. Maybe you should have been thinking when you installed the sign. Dumbass. No. Hmm, hmm, hmm. under it. Ooh, more penetration ammo there. Let's go ahead and do the, the epic drop trick once again. Cha! Is this paint can gonna. Oh, I swear some of those paint cans do that. Maybe I'm thinking of a different game. Game tricked you. It's like, oh, now you can't go through here. Pistol ammo. Fuck yeah. Go ahead and dump those. Very epic. I think you can't... Oh, no, that's an instant death. It doesn't just damage you. It just kills you. I was thinking maybe we could walk through it for... Epic lols. The fire and rescue guys are here. Once they've got the fire under control, we can check the rubble. Let them handle it. I need you on standby to head inside armor camp as soon as the site is secure. Roger. The light rays going through. Like, I'm sorry. I newer games don't look this good. Look at that light coming through the grate there. Like because it's lower res and sharper, you can actually see the individual rays. They didn't add 10,000 layers of whatever kind of after effects, post-processing garbage to it. They just said, here's the image. Here it is. Like, they didn't fuck with it so much that it looks like ass. Like, it's, it's, it's kind of like the engineer's dilemma shit, where it's like, well, we have to innovate. We have to make new things. We have to change. What if something's perfect as it is? What if that's the case? How do you, what do you, what do you do? I mean, really, what they should have done is, you know, improve the pistol textures, because they kind of look a little bit low-res. But, other than that, I mean, this is this is perfect. Like, that's like, that looks like a fucking work of art, man. I This rat's like, I'm just admiring the art. Do you have a piece of cheese for me? Oh, there's a little bastard in here, and if we're fe very quick... We can kill him. Can we kill him or not? Yeah, fuck you, you dickhead. 
you're not supposed to be able to kill him. He's supposed to run away, and it's just supposed to be a set piece. But if you're very, if you know he's gonna show up, you can kill him. I love that shit. You can't escape from me, you little f word. Now, unfortunately, these guys don't drop any cool weapons, but these are the fucking invisible guys. They look like that. He looks like that guy from Hellboy, the the ancient Nazi dude who's like blood is turned to dust and he runs on clockwork mechanisms. He's like, I represent the amphibian people of Alpha Seti 9. So we have tons of ammo. Shadow on the wall of the other guy, he's waiting. You can join your friend as an alt beast pinned to the wall. It's like feels like it feels like when you have a hangover. Oh, <laughs> my brain. Dehydrated, help me. Got the fucking alarm off. It's me off. It's like the smoke detector beep. <laughs> These guys are like, I don't hear anything. <laughs> what do you mean there's an alarm? I don't hear anything. Okay, that room is pointless. Oh no, there's a... There's an Easter egg area down here. Um, there's actually a really funny. There's a funny room. There's a bunch of funny um, secret rooms in this game with like little developer nods and references in them. Um, this is where we're supposed to go. Okay, so this means the other place. There's a there's a way to get on top of the um, ledge where the the invisible amphibian frog faced Hellboy dude jumped from. I think it's up here, isn't it? Yes, yes, it is. Mm. Yes, very epic. Fuck, did we have to... God damn it. How the fuck do you get there? Aha! The plot thickens. Here we are. Walkway there. Is there any shit over here? God, just the the mood of this game, the fucking gungy, rusty, dirty ass look of everything. The, the industrial gunge is so fucking well done in this. Wee -hoo -hoo. I'm wasting ammo. Ain't that fun? Oops, dropped my gun. And almost full ammo. I think 250 is the max for this. Uh, do we have first full first aid? Yeah, as I said, we have well, fucking full first aid perpetually now. Nation, if only. Oh. That's all we have to do down here. Head back to the actual plot of the game. Um... One of those secret rooms is really funny. There's like a radio playing some kind of like Japanese anime song. Um, it's really hard to find. You're in another sewer area kind of like this. And um, it's much later in the game, but if you head to... If you head up on a bunch of pipes and go through like six different little secret entrances, you end up in this room with a bunch of like weird jokes like on a... on a... on like a... a, a dry erase board. And while you're in that room, there's a radio that's playing, like, some sort of anime theme song. It's really fucking stupid, but I, lo I, don't know, I love that kind of shit in games like this. They put something very jokey and not serious in this very serious game in order to offset the horror and tension. That's heckin' awesome, bro. Alright, let's check our totally not sponsored Alienware PC here with its ancient trackpad. Fucking hell. With two gigabytes of RAM. 
You could never possibly need more than that. Okay, so the Ohio spill. Hmm, very interesting. Now, what do we have here? Proximity mine? Oh shit, is there one of those scoped rifles in here? I think there is. If so, I'm fucking Jones in for that. Yeah, baby! Okay, this thing is fucking fantastic. I'm tempted to just get rid of the shotgun for it. How much pistol ammo do we have? We have a ton of pistol ammo. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and ditch this piece of shit. I mean, ugh, I have a lot of ammo for it though. Fuck. We, we're not gonna ditch this. The shotgun, I... Sorry, I know, I know, I'm sorry, Civvy. I know you love the shotgun. Doesn't matter, he's never gonna see this. But uh, if, you, if you've seen Civvy's, Civvy11, great YouTuber by the way, check him out. He reviews FPS games. Uh, older ones that are very good, or janky and funny. He has uh, a video about this game where he, he, he lauds it for how good the shotgun is. I agree, it's a good weapon, but if I, if I have the choice between, you know, my third slot being occupied by that versus this, I'm going to go ahead and pick this. And I love the pistols in this game, I love the John Woo shit. Um, that's a game I really should play, is, uh, is the, uh, uh, the John Woo, uh, whatever they're called, games. I forget the the titles, but uh, they, these are well made, goddamn, you can't even break the screen, look at that, bulletproof shit, company who makes those, good, good on you, fucking bulletproof security monitors, convenient, they got those at the gun range, you can shoot them, a bullet will ricochet, hit you right in the head, <laughs> that's what happened to me, my doctors say my IQ got cut in half, luckily I was a genius beforehand, now I'm just normal. Okay, that just leaves back there. There's another one of those rifles too, so we can do the drop trick, I th think. Um, to make sure there's no fuckers down. Back that gat up now! We missed an area up there. Maybe I'm just being paranoid, but mm, let's see. What do we have here? Do these guys drop anything worthwhile? You guys have HIV? I really want some HIV. I want some HIV penetration. Does anyone here have HIV? Guys, I'm looking for HIV. I'm a bug chaser. Does anybody have HIV? Please tell me you have HIV. Does someone have HIV? I only have 225, 224 HIV. I want 250 HIV. Does anyone have HIV? Uh, let's see here. We not, I thought we missed something up here. Or am I just fucking losing my shit? Oh no, yeah, see, look at this. We missed whatever's up here. Oh no, this is back where we came from. Okay, I'm an idiot, Never mind. I could have sworn we missed something, but I think we've checked this whole place out. Now there's a big, Big area coming up, which is why we got this bad boy. Now break it in and crack some craniums, chrome some domes. That's a gr I love that phrase for like shooting shit. It's like I'm gonna chrome your dome. I fucking love that. A buddy of mine used to play a lot of Halo, um, Halo Reach or Halo Three multiplayer back in the day, and he he had a friend who was like they were living together in a place for university one time, and they were like. This dude, this, this dude would get really high and they'd play Halo, and he'd be like, when he'd ask my buddy, you know, you want to play, he'd be like, hey man, you want to chrome some domes? <laughs> fucking stupid shit. Uh, Alright, so let's chrome some domes here. Foul movement! I'm gonna brown! Is 
Gotta watch out, because these guys will... Yep, do that. Woo! I don't appreciate that, sir. That was rather rude. The fuck are they? I think they straight up just start walking into the building, and they'll just walk up here and kill you. Go out here, we can go down. I think we're gonna go down, actually. I don't want to waste the ammo for that. Uh, that scoped rifle is so useful for, for later areas in the game where you have, a, you have to fight a shit ton of these guys at once. It for now. That's it for now. Now there's another one of those rifles. We're gonna do the epic drop trick. Have this. What do we have here? Some old English. Hell yeah, man. What does it say? Old. Old bum. <laughs> what are these books? Let's check these books out. What does this say? Uh. The something and something div DVD books. I can't read that. Guys, increase the texture resolution. I can't even read the book objects. All right, 54 shots. That's what I'm fucking talking about. Now, should we John Woo it or should we... Hmm, what kind of grenades we have? We got landmines. We got the proximity grenades. I think we'll just switch stick to regular grenades for this next little bit here. Uh oh. They're sticking their gats out. Oh, you have HIV, bro. Awesome. Thanks for the HIV, bro. Appreciate it. Now... Anybody else here have HIV? Anyone? Any of you guys? I really need it. I'm, I'm, I'm really, I'm really jonesing for it. Oh man, look at that. You can see how long these fucking projectiles are. Look at that shit. That is vicious. Damn. It's like shooting someone with a railroad spike. Fucking brutal, man. Uh, is there anything in down here? Do we miss any objects? No, we're good. Okay. Let's continue our journey. Half the time, these barrels just end up killing you in this room, so I end up- I usually just blow them up before I do this part. Um, you can use them to kill the other guys, of course, but the- Half the time, they just end up- They just end up blowing up because of ricocheted bullets, and then you end up dying as a result of the barrels. More of those fucking things. Oh, I think- The tank in this room, too. Scoped rifle would be a bad idea because this is close quarters, so we're going to stick with, I think, this or the pistols. Thank you. 
young boy, you get over here. Come over and see Uncle Ruckus. I got a railroad spike for your chest. There you go. Nothing like a nice, cool railroad spike on a hard morning. Nothing like some nice HIV when you're in an industrial maze and getting shot at by clones. I just love hanging out with the boys. You know, he's just chilling. He's sitting down here. He's contemplating his life. I love it. Very cool. Whoa! I've got some HIV for you, my friend. Let it into you. Look at them leaping over the ledge there. Fucking amazing, man. Right now, that heavy, I don't think we got him. He's sneaking around back there very quietly. There he is. Fuck, man, he moves quick. Love their death sound, man. It's like a fucking lion roaring. <laughs> Fuck. All right now, where's your HIV? He's given us some HIV as well. Very nice of him. Very considerate. Uh, we have ten med kits right now. Chew one up here. And what about these gentlemen? Did they drop any HIV for us? No, they're clean. They've been using prep. They don't have HIV. For you. Heard somebody needed some fucking. Oh, 225 is the max. Okay. Oh, well, 250 because we have 25 in the chamber. Okay. All right. So we have max ammo for this. That's fucking amazing. We can save the other weapons. Save our pistol ammo, since pistol is my... F I think pistols are better than the shotgun. I'm straight up going to say it. I think they're better than the shotgun in this game. They're more fun, anyway, even if they're not better. They're just more fun. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Fuck, man. What happens if we... We get this to pin. Can we get this pinned to the wall? Oh, it just deletes the projectile. Okay. What about the paint can? Can we pin the paint can to the wall? Ah, oh, it just deletes the. Oh no, there we go. There's the. I guess they persist in the walls, but not on the paint cans. My analysis of this game has concluded that the paint cans cannot make the projectiles persist from the HIV penetrator. This is vital information for anyone wanting to play this game. Nice proximity mine, very good, very good. Now, what do we have in here? Ah, we have the exit window there. We have another w weird book. The Diarrhea of Anal DVDs. I don't know what that fucking says. Uh, what about over here? Okay, we got... We got Bimbo Grimbo waiting over there to read us our last rites. Perhaps it will be me who reads you your last rites. Once I save, once I save scum, the power of save scumming, I will defeat you. The power of corner looking. Power of staying by this corner, I will kill you all. Target penetrated! Woo! Mm. 
right in the dick. Fuck you, dude. All right, board complete. But these guys dropped here. Keep your eyes open for that black cock, excuse me? What the fuck is wrong with you? There's children watching this. I hope there aren't. <laughs> but I'm just gonna stay in here. It's nice and comfy in here. Hmm. Alright, guys. I think uh, we're gonna end the video here, because this has been a long one, I have a feeling. Just like me. Uh, so, we're gonna uh, end the video. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed things. And uh, tune in, stay tuned for more, because I'm going to play through this entire game and the expansions, I think. I'm really into it. I haven't played through this in a couple of years, so the whole game is nice and fresh and delicious uh, to my brain, which has forgotten most of it. Except for, you know, every location of every secret and enemy in the entire game. Uh, I haven't forgotten that. So, uh, again, hope you're doing well. Hope you had a good Thanksgiving if you're uh, hailing from the U.S. of A. And uh, if not, I hope you're having a good holiday, or almost the holidays. Uh, if you're in school, it's the sort of crunch time for essays and shit. I know the feeling. Uh, I've been in school for like over a decade, uh, post-secondary type shit. So I'm very used to the late fall deadline kind of feeling. Um, so if you're, if you're grinding through that, keep your, keep your chin up, keep banging against that brick wall. Eventually it'll break. Um, and yeah, stay happy, stay healthy. And as always, peace out.